Okay, well, here we are, well into the fourth week of house arrest. No ankle bracelet needed. Last week, I was hooked on a jigsaw puzzle, but that got too frustrating, so I moved on to crosswords. When I was unable to finish even one, I wanted to move on, but I'm no math whiz, so Sudoku's out of the question. I was trying to save Angry Birds until I got desperate, but here I am, deep into the mystery of how you kill pigs with birds and progress through the levels. At first it was easy. I zipped right up. Then about level 20 they started to get more difficult. Frustrating. You need more and more stars which are harder to get with each rising level. But I persevered. I must be a masochist or extremely bored. I haven't decided which yet. I am now at level 29, game 80, and I need 10 more stars to get to the next level. I've played all the games that might give me more stars so I can advance, but no luck so far. If anyone has any stars they could spare, please send some my way. I was playing what I thought was a simple level that might help my progress, but now I can't even finish that one again. I let fly a particular lethal bomb that might do the job, but just as I let go, my Twix fell out of my hand and screwed up the shot. It fell on the keyboard and the bomb went whirling off into space. You would think with all those pigs and obstacles in the way, it would hit something, but no. It turned left at the tower and came back down, and now I thought it was sure to hit something, but a bubble lifted it out of range, never to be seen again. I swear, one of the pigs laughed and jumped off the screen and grabbed what was left of the Twinkie I was holding in my other hand. No wonder my shooting is so bad. Both hands are so sticky my fingers can't navigate the touch screen. I guess I'll wash my hands as soon as I get done with this level. Never mind, I'll just lick my fingers. As I said before, I'm no quitter. Oh, I just destroyed a whole village full of pigs. Now they're really angry. I thought the birds were supposed to be angry, but it turns out the pigs have more to lose. Those birds are ruthless and mean. Some of them, some of them laugh as you launch them into space, and the pigs scream when hit. I think some of the birds are deranged. One of the birds is very large and is a bomb for maximum effect. If you let him land, then touch the screen, there's a very satisfying explosion. But alas, not enough to get a big score to get another star. Then there are the tournaments. Every few days we get a new one. At first they seem easy, and if you get in on the beginning, you can get first place. For a moment, until some smarter and obviously younger contestant sends you down to 11th place. These games are obviously not meant for old fingers. I bet a three-year-old could beat the pants off of me. Does anyone have a three-year-old they can loan me for a few days? Never mind, they are rumored to be germ farms and not safe around their elders. I am, however, getting to a point where I'm thinking of risking it. Crap, one of the birds flew out and grabbed what was left of my last ding-dong. Now I'm going to have to break open the chips and salsa. I'm nothing if not well stocked. I'm out of eggs, bread, milk, toilet paper, and anything of nutritional value, but I have snacks. Just thinking of running out of those will drive me to Lyra's. I'm too embarrassed and proud to have these guilty pleasures delivered. Maybe I can sneak in and get out if I wear my dark glasses and a mask. They want us to do that now anyway, so I won't be noticed. Off I go. If you have any stars, please send them. Don't worry about food. I can live off my fat for weeks, and we still have running water. I might even lose some weight. Never mind, I just discovered another secret stash. I'm good for now, so back to Angry Birds. Have a nice day.